Hey guys, seems like we finally are getting some JavaScript benchmarks of this new iPad 2 and this new iOS 4.3. And it is really cool actually because CNET UK, CNET in UK, they have been trying the SunSpider JavaScript benchmark test that I have been using in all of my Google Chrome versus Opera and the Firefox versus you know, Inter Explorer 9 and this is a very good test to see how fast your internet browser is how fast so, so, oh my god oh my god it just fall down yeah, crazy, that's that's just snow guys you know, you, you could you can be calm, you know I'm not going to die here but okay, okay, so anyways so JavaScript, is, it's very important to see how like fast your web browser is performing Obviously, JavaScript is not everything, but it seems like the iPad 2 of the CNET, CNET in UK tried out this SunSpider JavaScript benchmark test. Comparing to the original iPad, the iPad 2 seems to be four times faster in JavaScript. So that is kind of impressive, but it's not all about the CPU and all of the upgrades in the new iPad 2 that is doing this in impressive performance. Four times faster, I mean, that's, that's sick. But when they updated the original iPad's OS to this new iOS 4.3, this little speed advantage that this four times faster, it dropped to just one and a half times faster. So... This is awesome news because that means that iOS 4.3 it have this new JavaScript thingy, so you will be able to browse faster just if you are updating to iOS 4.3. So it's not just all about the the new hardware in the iPad 2, but it's also this new iOS 4.3 that is really you know making some improvements to your browsing experience. So it's perfect if you want to like go ahead and buy an iPad, you can buy the original iPad right now, upgrade to iOS 4.3 and browse even faster than you have been able to do before. And now, right now, the iPad, original iPad, they are kind of like cheap right now, so if you just want to like, you know, go ahead and browse fast and stuff like that, then you probably should buy one of those, because I mean, iPad 2, yeah, they got some new cool features, they got cameras, they got, you know, dual core processor and some cool things like A5 processor, but if you don't need that, then, you know, just go ahead and buy the original iPad, I mean, I'm not going to bully you or anything, but, yeah, guys, this is just awesome news, so, yeah, see you.